Okay, so there is actually a new Five Nights at Freddy's teaser. Um, it's um it just has FNAF or Five Nights at Freddy's at the top there. Of course, there's Scott Games there, but also it says Security Breach, and then it's like a neon sign. So, yeah, I don't know. It's kind of a weird teaser, but um, it's like it looks like it has Glamrock Freddy there because of like the shoulder thingies. And that looks like it would be him. So, yeah, I don't know what, like, this is supposed to be. I mean, I guess, like, the whole security breach thing down there is, like, I guess that would be kind of obvious. But, like, I don't know. Obviously, it's, like, someone, like, got into, like, the animatronics, like, I guess programming or something so then they're like controlled by this other person that got to them I don't know but it's like I guess it would be William Afton if he was glitch trap and then he like used his glitch trap abilities and like possessed them or something <laughs> and like kind of put some like extra coding into their system and like messed with them so now he can kind of like control them or something I don't know or like it's like a extra part of William Afton put into them and then they're, now they're like evil or something so yeah <laughs> I guess that's probably what it is I'm guessing anyways don't really completely know but yeah the Scott Games logo at the top there is like changing with each teaser. I don't know if it did that before. I think most of the time it would just be like blue or something. I think usually it would be like blueish white or whatever. So it'd be kind of like a light blue with a bit of white there. But now it's like changing with each teaser. So that um that teaser was it the last teaser? I think it was the last teaser that was the crocodile one or alligator or whatever he's supposed to be. But it was the Scott Games logo up there was green because, you know, crocodiles and alligators are kind of that greenish color. I think one of them is kind of more of a brownish color, but whatever. <laughs> Usually in cartoons and stuff, they're like a greenish color, so. Yeah, but now it's red with this teaser because, like, it's a red neon sign. So it's kind of like, oh, red for, like, danger or something. So, yeah. And then there's just the Five Nights at Freddy's, like, type of stuff there on the teaser. But yeah, I guess, um, this will be linked in the description. Obviously, if the teaser changes, I'm guessing that the, it won't work anymore, or it won't be this teaser anymore if it changes. So, like, you, if I put the link in the description and it changes, then it'll be a different thing. Like, yeah. <laughs> I don't think anyone would really be surprised. Actually, I should, like, check... I should check, um... FNAF World 1, which I don't think the FNAF one World would have any teasers. Yeah, it's just, like, the black screen still, so it's just, like... That doesn't have anything, so whatever. So FNAF World hasn't had a teaser in a little while. I think it had Friday in Space 2 teaser and then it's just been a black screen ever since then so I don't know there's not really anything with the FNAF world thing like there's no been no teaser since then on there I guess if there is a teaser on FNAF world then I could make a video about that but there isn't right now so yeah I don't know I guess it's just another Glamrock teaser thing for the game that will be out this year, I guess. I'm pretty sure it was a 2020 thing. So yeah, I don't know how much longer we're gonna have to wait for this game, but I guess probably not that long because, you know, if it's 2020, then it's not gonna be that long. So yeah, <laughs> um, I feel like waiting too long for something would be like it makes the hype die down kind of like with FNAF the movie one like Five Nights at Freddy's movies like we've been waiting like what like five years for those and like I don't know like Scott wants to get the um scripts perfects 
perfect. So of course it's gonna probably take a while, but it's been like five years. Also, I think Scott wanted to work with one studio and then like it didn't work or like it didn't work out or whatever and then he was just like fine bye whatever and so he like left them and like to go find another studio i think he's trying to work with another studio now so yeah and i think it's just like five years is kind of a lot for this i don't know how long do movies usually take i feel like movies probably take about like two three years to do all the stuff so yeah i don't know probably quite a while and then they don't come out till like another like year or something like that so <laughs> i don't know movies take a lot because you gotta like make the scripts get the actors film all the stuff and edit whatever stuff that needs to be edited and yeah you have to just do all of the stuff for movies it also depends on like what kind of stuff you need to edit too and like yeah <laughs> so i wouldn't be surprised if a movie does take quite a few years but i don't know it's just like i feel like they should have announced a fnaf movie when it, they had like most of the stuff like already in progress like they should have had the movies in progress already and then be like oh hey here's we're gonna have FNAF movies but like I don't know I feel like it was kind of just like hey this is an idea that we had and then it was like oh wait it's not gonna be a thing for another however many years <laughs> so it kind of like the hype for the FNAF movies kind of died down and apparently the FNAF movies are only going to cover 1, 2, and 3 so it's only going to be like the first three games that they're going to have the movies based off of so it's going to be FNAF 1, FNAF 2, and FNAF 3 and then yeah I mean FNAF 3 I feel like it would be really cool to see Springtrap even though I feel like not that many people liked FNAF 3 though I don't know <laughs> but yeah anyways um, I kind of started o talking about the movie after like four or five minutes, <laughs> so like, rip. I I just, like stop talking about this teaser here. But yeah, I, I don't think there's really that much to talk about for the teaser. Er, <laughs> teaser. <laughs> what are words? I'm like saying other words instead of like the actual word that I'm supposed to say. <laughs> what even? But yeah. It's just like there's not that much here for the teaser. Like I could only speculate so much for what this teaser is. So like I don't really know. So like it'd be like why not talk about something else too? Cause I don't know. I feel like it would be too short of a video just to be like, oh hey, here's the teaser. That's it. Okay, bye. <laughs> like that'd probably only take like a minute or two. But yeah. Anyways, it's just like if. I feel like what's the point if I'm gonna only make um, a video that's like one minute long it's like kind of like what's the point like I mean I, I've made some videos that are like a minute long but that's only cause like there isn't much to it or like I don't need to make it to like super long like the smite victory and loose screens I only make those like a few seconds or a, a minute or two long because it's like I don't need them to be that long like, they don't need to be, like, five minutes long or ten minutes long or whatever, but I feel like something like a FNAF teaser would have to be a few, a few minutes long instead of just one minute long. Like, I don't know. But yeah, I just kind of, I guess, hey, here's a teaser, and then also what, what what's going on with the movie? But, like, I guess it's just, like, Scott wants to get stuff perfect, and Scott wants to do all this stuff and just make the fans happy and yeah get everything perfect and then also with the um FNAF calendar thing where that got leaked Scott was like really disappointed and like whoever messed that up it's like they must feel so terrible or like they better feel terrible because like yeah <laughs> Scott's really disappointed in whatever messed up on that or whoever messed up on that like I don't know I feel like 
what was it that calendar is supposed to be like shown on like June fifteenth or something, and then it, it got showed like a month or two early, and so it was kind of like rip. <laughs> but I don't know. Apparently the the models for those animatronics weren't even done either, so it's like the calendar being leaked was pretty like rip. <laughs> Like, we weren't supposed to see those. Apparently they weren't supposed to be done either. Or they weren't done anyways. Or whatever. So, like, we got to see, like, a, a draft of them or something. I don't know, I guess. But, <laughs> yeah. Anyways, I think I should end this video here. I don't want it to be too long. But, yeah. And there's not really much to talk about for this either. Because there isn't really that much. It's just, oh, hey, Glamrock Freddy. And then whatever. Words. Text. But, yeah. Anyways, I guess that'll be it for this video, so bye!